Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all of my empty products. So things that I used up um, over the summer. It's been that long since I've done an empties video and things I've used up recently. So if you want to see my most used products, then just keep watching. Okay, so I have two bags full of empties that I have been waiting to share with you guys. So let's just jump right in. So a moisturizer that I was loving over the winter is the Aveeno Positively Nourishing Comforting Cocoa and Shea Butter Whipped Souffle. Um, yes, please. I have two of them right here. They are empty. This is the best moisturizer and the only place I can find it is Walmart. So um, if you can get your hands on this, it's a great moisturizer. It's lightweight, but still moisturizes just like a heavy, rich butter. Uh, I have two of the MAC Studio Fix powders in NC45. So they are done for. I'm going to back to MAC these. This is what I was using in like kind of like my everyday bronzer. So I just get um, a little bit extra coverage from it and it just smooths and perfects the skin and gives me that really flawless finish. So I love the MAC Studio Fix powder. I finally used up my MAC Soft and Gentle. You guys know if you watch my videos for a long time, you know that I am obsessed with this highlighter, but it was causing a little bit of texture along the tops of my cheeks. So I think I was using it a little bit too much, but I love MAC Soft and Gentle. It's a great staple in my makeup kit and my own personal kit. Um, my favorite foundation is the Makeup Forever foundation in um, 127, and I have two of them here. I love this foundation for an everyday foundation, kind of like any time foundation. If I don't want to like question what I'm going to be wearing, what it's going to do on my face, things like that, I know that this stays put, gives me a flawless finish, and um, I don't really need to set it, so I love this foundation. Okay, <laughs> I found another um, MAC Studio Fix in the bottom of the um, back. So here's another MAC Studio Fix in NC45 for bronzing. I have seven brow pencils. Six of them are MAC Lingering. This is one of my favorite brow pencils, but it goes out so fast. I love using this on clients. It stays put. And then the last one is, the seventh one is the NARS Caucus. I love this one because it has a slanted tip and it's the perfect shade for me. But again, goes out so quick. So I just have been getting some at the drugstore because those are expensive. I think they're like 16 bucks. Um, let's see here. I have two of the Chanel Le Volume Mascaras. I get the regular kind that is not waterproof and just in black. This is my all-time favorite mascara. I have two eyelash glues, um, both by Duo. One is the brush on adhesive with vitamins. I don't like this. It leaves a like blue-green iridescence on my lashes and it doesn't adhere very well. And then my trusty dark shade of the dark tone of the Duo eyelash adhesive. I love this glue. Um, a beauty blender that needs to go. It is so dirty. Um, my favorite lip liner in strip down. I can't even sharpen it anymore. You know if you follow me for a long time, this is my favorite lip liner. The perfect brown tone. Um, and then two concealers. One is the Stila, I think it's the Aqua Glow. Yeah, Aqua Glow Serum Concealer. I love this for a nice bright under eye. And then the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer, which is an all-time favorite, and I'm in the shade Custard. And then this is something that I enjoyed using, but it's too light. It's the Gimme Brow. There's like no writing on it by Benefit. I love that. And then I have four of the MAC Skinner, Skinner, <laughs> MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Dark Deep and Dark Deep and Dark Deep and Dark Deep. So this is what I was using for a long time to bronze my face. Um, but I can't even show you what it looks like because they are all gone. So I'm going to back to Mac those. The last of the makeup are two of my very favorite lipstick in the entire world. It is a cream sheen by Mac and it is Japanese maple. This is the perfect nude. It pairs with strip down so beautifully and they are both gone. So 
perfect nude. I love this formula of lipstick. It is so wonderful. Two more MAC products. I have the uh, MAC Fix Plus and the MAC Turquatic. This is my favorite summertime fragrance. I go through fragrance like I don't even know what. And this is my signature scent and it's very inexpensive. I think this is like mm, under $40. I found another Aveeno um, Positively Nourishing. This is really good stuff. And then a really great deodorant that I use that helps me from not sweating and not having um, any kind of stint or anything like that is the Mitchum Clinical. This is the only underarm care that I use and it's the only thing that works for me. So if you're having trouble with um, finding a good deodorant, this is a good one. Now some hair care products. I have the Redken All Soft Heavy Cream. I love this as a summertime mask. It's lightweight but still deeply nourishes um, blonde hair. And one of my favorite toothpaste, the Crest 3D White. I'm using the Colgate um, Express White right now. I went through a ton of these lotions, but I only saved one to show you guys. The St. Ives um, Fresh Hydration Lotion. This is amazing lotion for spraying on. It's very lightweight and it feels light and pure on skin. Oatmeal and shea butter. Fast absorbing, non-greasy. It's not greasy at all. So these are great, great lotions to have. It's good for like if you're going to the beach or something like that and you don't want your lotion spilling all out in your um, bags, you can get that lotion or any spray lotion and they're really good. Shampoo and conditioner that I went through is the Hydrate by Pureology. And um, I'm going to be giving away the blue um, strength cure line from Pureology. So I'm going to be giving away a shampoo and conditioner to one lucky winner. All you have to do is follow me on YouTube here on my YouTube channel and follow me on Instagram and leave me a comment down in the description bar and you will win that shampoo and conditioner. So um, it's great for all hair types and it's just really strengthening and I love the Pureology line and I paid for it myself so it is a gift from me not the company. Um, and yeah so I just thought that would be fun to do a little giveaway. My all-time favorite dry shampoo is the Moroccan Oil Dry Shampoo for light tones, um, and they have dark tones. This smells incredible, gives me nice volume, um, and did I mention it smells incredible? <laughs> this is a great dry shampoo. It's just expensive, so I'm using the Not Your Mother's, I think it's called, um, from Target. Three more products. Um, Miss Lisa turned me on to this. It is the Shea... Sugar Scrub by Tree Hut, the Coconut Lime. This smells incredible, um, but I'm getting rid of it because it's been in my shower for a really long time, and I just want to get a fresh one, a new one, and it's inexpensive. So uh, I love this right here, and you can find it at Publix, Kroger. Actually, I don't know about Kroger, but I know Walmart and Target and Publix has it. My favorite drugstore deep conditioning mask for my hair is the 3 Minute Aussie Miracle Moist. What an awful word. Uh, the 3 Minute Mask by Aussie. This is a great conditioning, makes my hair soft, doesn't weigh it down. Um, great conditioner. I love that conditioner. And then the last thing that I have is one of my favorite um, salicylic cleansers for my skin. My skin looked incredible when I used this. It is the Image Skincare Clear Cell Salicylic Gel Cleanser. And you can get this at your dermatologist. I think you get it on Amazon. I will link it through Amazon, but I don't recommend buying it through Amazon because you never know what you're getting unless it is actually from the brand or a preferred dermatologist, um, a licensed dermatologist. So. I will link it through Amazon. I don't recommend you buying it through Amazon, but I will link it so you can read more about it. That is it for my most used empty products. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of makeup, a lot of powder, um, and a lot of eyebrow pencils. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will leave all the products linked down in the description bar. Thank you so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like empty videos, um, empties videos, and be sure to follow me on Instagram. I post lots of outfits, um, lots of makeup, lots of swatches, things like that. So I'll leave my Instagram down in the description bar as well. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you again real soon. Oh, and if you want to know what's on my face, 
be um, be sure to subscribe because I'm gonna be posting a tutorial uh, doing this makeup. It's a glowy, dewy foundation routine and you don't wanna miss it. Okay, thanks guys, bye.